bit? Yeah, I mean, he's just very hard and he's very uh, demanding, but he's obviously so strong of a character that I think, like, I think time will serve him well. I think he'll only get better as people get more consistent. But going against Yoshi. Oh, and oh. starting off with a almost 80% combo. Beautiful uh, catch on that um, platform with the jab reset. Mm -hmm. What an insane start for a Whirlpool washing machine. Yeah, a really good start for here for it. Oh, and already one stock gone, uh, gone by Hero. Uh, and Whirlpool Washing Machine is a very, really safe spot. He's just doing these amazing. He's just juggling <laughs> this poor Pikachu. Oh, going and, uh, for it all right there. It really went for the this hole in the game right there. Yeah, this this can happen where like you just start off with so much momentum that Hero has had zero time to think. Mm -hmm. He's been getting hit so much that he doesn't even know what to do because when you just get so overwhelmed, it's really hard to play any sort of like an adaptation, you know, because you're in the middle of a Yoshi combo. That means that finally having some time to think, finally getting his own hits in, he's going to need a lot more than just his 32% though to mount this comeback. Yeah, he's really going to have to put some effort in to tr even make some of a comeback. Uh, Whirlpool, I'm talking Whirlpool, <laughs> is really being the aggressor, going right in, approaching, even though he is clearly in the lead and winning. He's yeah. just not afraid of this Pikachu whatsoever. And, oh, I thought it was over. And I think that lack of respect is what's giving him this such a huge mm -hmm. lead, you know? You're not even letting Pikachu set up what makes Pikachu strong. You're not even letting Pikachu throw out these Thunder Shorts, throw out these, like, short hop bears. Absolutely nothing is being done from Hero, and because of that, no matter how good you are, if you aren't pressing buttons, you can't utilize your character. Mm -mm. And right here, Rorpool is just waiting for the perfect opportunity to get that for, to get Hero. Hero's, ooh, that was really good. But Hero still needs just so much more to come back. And very beautiful waiting from Pro, just waiting for Pikachu to do something and punish it and take a stock. Oh, and this could be another huge combo mm -hmm. dropping it, but we saw the first two stocks getting literally like 80% combos off the bat. Yoshi's combo game is so strong, and I think a lot of it is maybe uh, because of these uh, PS2 platforms, he's been able to extend off it really well. So mm -hmm. maybe we'll see an FD counter pick next game, but that's assuming Hero loses, which seems very likely with the way that things are currently going. Seems like Whirlpool is very confident, both on the stage and in the on the stage and in the air, which is really deadly for someone like Pikachu, who just it goes everywhere. And if you and Whirlpool's there right to catch Hero, right there, probably uh, trying to read a spot dodge maybe with mm -hmm. that F smash. I think he was trying to read him getting out of shield early, but he didn't. I'm just standing Red. at ledge. Look at that. See, now, now Hero's trying to play safe. Finally a stock from Hero, but he still has such a big disadvantage. He's going to have to avoid all of Whirlpool's incoming combos, which might be coming up right now. Yep, and there it is. Very good first game from both players. I just think that Whirlpool is insane with those combo stars. 80% off the bat in the first, what, 10 seconds? Yeah, 80% twice in like the first 30 seconds. Like, yeah. Yeah, Um, I think... But honestly, so Hero got to this point where he took, he lost the stock and then got 0 to 80 and then he basically started playing the game. And once he started actually being able to play the game, he was keeping it very competitive with uh, Whirlpool. So I think for Hero, it's really just going to be about knowing that Whirlpool's going for these combo starters off the bat. You're going to be mm -hmm. fishing for up tilts and F tilts and fares and nares, a lot of Yoshi's kit. And looks like they're bringing it back on. Happen. Yeah, and they're, they're bringing it over on Battlefield. And... Okay, so I think Hero got a wake-up call last round and was like, alright, now I have to actually really focus here. Because he's not letting Hero do his 0-80% to 80 combos. I mean, Washing uh, wash Machine do the, those combos. Yeah, this choice to Battlefield can be scary because we saw how good the platform extensions were on FD, and I wonder if the third, uh, even higher platform could potentially lead to something. Fortunately, getting out of that combo, and getting out of that one too, both could have been more percent.
but I think uh, Hero, what his game plan is, is being really defensive, kind of using these platforms as a bit of a shield. Mm -hmm. uh, and that's what it seems to be doing with these like fade back thunder jolts on the platforms. And that, I don't know, that could kind of be caught on by Yoshi because of how good his airspeed and mobility is in general. He's able to catch Pikachu even from pretty far away doing these thunder jolts. So you got to be really careful with how you throw them out. I completely agree, yeah. And here we already see Eat Washing Machine is using those platforms for his advantage, just like he did in PS2. Ooh, that would have been killer if I had hit. And here you see he's probably gonna go up and try to get that get hero stock, but hero did come back on the ledge on the stage, thankfully. Still at a really big disadvantage. And right here, it's I think Hero is playing really fearful. He's needing a lot of these things um, because he knows if he loses the stock right here, he's going to be in a position to get Yoshi comboed again, and that almost was it. So I think if Hero wants a fighting chance in this game, he's going to be having to play super clean here and do some more percent before losing the stock, or just take the stock first. I'll take the stock first, yep, and just set it back to neutral, hopefully. But he does have to be really be careful here because now, again, just like you said, now he's in a disadvantage. One stock like down than uh, than Whirlpool, and now here comes Whirlpool's combos that zero to sixty within maybe ten seconds of, of <laughs> Hero coming back on the stage. Yeah, and, and that's like a bad combo. Mm -hmm. Like that that was not the best that he could have done. And this is the thing like Yoshi's at ninety five, but Yoshi's really heavy, and like Pikachu doesn't really kill with raw kill power. Mm -hmm. They like kill with like confirms that are gonna be so tough to get on such an aerial opponent that has jump armor as well. So like I could see. Uh, watch the machine easily live for like 40, 50 more percent. Yeah. Cannot say the same for Hero though. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Whirlpool still having three stocks. Hero down his last one. I mean, he could bring it back. I always believe in everybody. I really believe he could bring it back. If he was, if he played the same kind of way he did in the beginning of this match, he's a little more safe. And right when I say something, here comes Washington. Oh, Whirlpool's zero, zero to 80%, really? Oh, and that would have ended it with mm -hmm. a little bit cleaner of timing. But yeah. If he was a little bit closer, a he would have gotten that read. Too. Okay, taking the double jump armor. Uh, I feel like you had to close it out mm -hmm. right there on that ledge. Now, 160%, you're at 90. Yoshi Rage, this could very easily be a three stock. Okay. He's not three stock. Again, and then 87 percent. Okay, 102. I was gonna say 87 percent, not too bad the disadvantage, but 102 might be a little bit. I'm. Mean, you're gonna need perfect play. Yeah. Perfect play, perfect combos, and that was already not perfect. But picking it up. I mean, Yoshi also hits really hard. Yeah. Oh yeah, and that's game. No, Yoshi is definitely one of those characters that comebacks are very, very tough mm -hmm. to make on with just their such raw defensive capabilities and just good, like, um, overall aerials. Like, all their aerials are really solid and do a lot of damage. Mm -hmm. I mean, that comeback was next to, like, impossible for Hero. You really, truly would have to play perfect. I mean, even when you, like, you, when you were talking about Yoshi's aerials and, and such, like, you can see Whirlpool using that to advantage.